G'day everyone, welcome back to the channel. In this episode, I'm gonna be continuing my series of debunking all the myths and falsehoods and misinformation about the F1 transmission. Um, if you click up here, you will see uh, one of my videos that I did uh, debunking a whole bunch of myths relating to the F1 transmission. Um, it annoys me a little bit that it gets so much bad press um, mainly through from motoring journalists who should know better quite frankly um, but uh, in this video I'm going to show you just how quickly this F1 transmission shifts now a lot of people say oh they're so slow and jerky oh you uh, uh, this happens when you yeah okay all right well for a start you've got to realize that it's a uh, it's, it's not an automatic, it's not a uh, torque converter automatic, it is a manual transmission. Completely the same as any other manual transmission, it's just that um, the gears are shifted by uh, the paddles here, which are connected to hydraulic actuators, um, which actually shift the gears and change, do essentially what the gear stick does, but it's done through here and through hydraulic uh, actuators, same with the clutch. Uh, there's a hydraulic actuator that separates the clutch plates and then bangs them together again. Um, check out here for my video about how a um, single clutch automatic transmission works. Um, but in this video, I just want to show you how quickly this transmission shifts. So in this car, if you actually read the manual, which is obviously the last thing that anybody does, you will notice that it says if you uh, if the engine speed is greater than 5,000 rpm and the throttle position is more than 80% towards wide open, it goes into a special uh, extra fast uh, shift pattern. And boy, is it quick! I only discovered this recently, and when you do it, it's just it's amazing. It's almost like a double clutch transmission. Anyway, I'm not going to say any more. I'll just let you listen to it now. Okay, so what we're going to do is we're going to just pull off and then we're going to change gears at 5,000 RPM and greater than and just wide open throttle and see what happens. So here we go. Here we go. Holy moly. <laughs> do you see what I mean? That is absolutely bonkers. fast. That was a five second naught to a hundred. It's pretty good. <laughs> it's pretty good really. What an amazing sound it makes too. Holy crap. <laughs> What's so amazing though is how quick those shifts are. It's like Bang, bang, bang. Remarkable. It goes into a different um, like shift program when you're above 5,000 RPM, more than 80% throttle. Just goes bonkers. Yeah, I don't want to have to replace the clutch. So, But all this video is really about is showing that the F1 transmission is absolutely no slouch. It, when it's required, it will bang in the gears fast as anything you like. And uh, you know, yes, it's rough on the clutch, so I'm not gonna do it again. We got about a five second zero to 60. I'm pretty happy with that, considering it's a 10 year old car and it's not ideal tires and everything. Um, so yeah, there we go. Another myth about the F1 transmission uh, completely busted. Uh, and that's just about it for this video. Let me know what you think uh, in the comments about the F1. Does it surprise you how quick it is when it actually gets going? That certainly surprised me when I experienced it for the first time. All right, that's it for this video. Uh, I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.